Hank Eradication, TGIM. Welcome to Monday. TG, I've never heard of that. Thank God it's Monday? Thank God it's Monday. Yeah, TGIM. A lot of people don't really look forward to Monday. They look forward to Friday. I look forward to Monday. Yeah, Monday's like a great Monday. opportunity. And today's 86. Man! The day before 87. <laughs> <laughs> Look at him. He's catching on quick. Oh, I know. So today is a good day. It's a good Monday. I'm excited to be here with you. Most of the represent. My it's the best Scouture. Monday that I've had all week. I'm just, I'm just going to throw that out there. It's the best one I've had all week. What makes it the best? <laughs> it's the only one I've had all week. <laughs> oh, that's clever. Dads. So what do you want to do today in Coronacation? Okay, so this is a special one. June. June. Focus. It's a special month. Is it your birthday month? Nope. Okay. I'll give you another hint. You did give me the first hint. <laughs> you asked a hint. I okay. said no. Okay. So, second hint. It's a tasty one. Um, June is tasty. You're going to have to give me more hints. Um... It's a sweet tasty month. It's a national sweet tasty month. And that's, national sweet tasty but month. That's not the Does name it of it. Have anything to do with cookies, candy? Oh, that's it. Candy. It is national, national candy month. Candy month. I knew there was yep. something going on. Somewhere there. on Google told me that. So. Well, it's on the internet, yep. so it's gotta be true. Yeah, it's pretty cool. So, I thought. We could do something with candy today. Okay, I'm a fan, as long as we can eat some. Well... What? You want to do stuff with candy and not actually eat candy? Well, I don't I don't have any candy. He is a dad. <laughs> <laughs> so, um... What's your favorite candy, Corey? Oh, uh, there's a lot of top-notch candies. I like the Twix. Ooh. I like the cookies and cream. Do you share your Twix? Because there's two of them. You have to. Cookies and cream, the kit bar. You don't know the bar? It's like white, with like a Hershey bar. Is it like a Hershey? It's like a Hershey's bar, but it's cookies and cream. But it's cookies and cream, so it's white Ooh, chocolate. That sounds really good. Oh, it is good. But the top one for me is Take Five. Do you know if the Take Five? I have heard of it. I don't think I've ever had one. So it is like caramel and chocolate and some peanut butter, but there's also a pretzel in it, and it's just the perfect mixture of sweet and salty. So those are my top three. What are your top three? Oh, easy. Reese's, Kit Kat, Starburst. Starburst? Yeah. I noticed one of these things is not like the other. They're not. It's the healthy one. Yeah, I didn't have a healthy one on my <laughs> list. And I don't and think you could say those are healthy. It, they're fruit snacks. They're not fruit juice. Snacks. They're not. They're fruity. They're probably zero okay. percent. They're not healthy. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm glad that you like them. I didn't know that you liked I probably wouldn't have picked them as your yeah. top candy. You place. actually made a special delivery to my house one time and brought me some Starburst. It's true. I was during my buddy. During COVID. We yeah. social distanced. It was like you threw them at my house. Pretty much. <laughs> some people throw yeah. eggs, I throw candy. I, I appreciated that. And while I do apologize for not having you candy. There's CVS. Like, right it there. is right there. Yeah. And I might have you something later. We'll see. Um, but I do have a game for you to play again okay. today. And it's candy trivia. Candy bar trivia. Candy bar trivia sounds doable. Did you make this game? I did make this game. Oh, it sounds more difficult than it originally probably, did. It probably is. <laughs> okay, so is there a premise behind the game? Can we knock that out right now? The premise is um, Coronacation will beat you. Whoa. That I <laughs> happen to be an expert in one thing. Sweet <laughs> treats is at the top. All right, well, there's some, there's some good ones in there. Bring it. We talk about Kit Kats, okay, and Reese's, yeah, and Snickers, okay. There's some other ones in there. Oh. Butterfinger. I'm not a big Butterfinger fan. Yeah, so it's okay. It's I, trivia around these it's candy trivia bars. trivia around candy bars. If it was a taste testing contest, I know I'd school you, but oh. with trivia, uh, it might be 50-50. We'll see. I like learning about things that I like about. Okay. Or that I like. That didn't make sense. I like learning about things that I like. There we go. Me too. Yeah. I think. Which, let's move on into our next little part. Okay, okay. so. So we'll play the game later. Play the game later. Learning. So I said Taste that. Taste testing? No. I like learning about things that I like. Okay. Okay. And I love 
the Lord, don't you? Yeah, absolutely. So I like to learn His Word, oh, put yeah. it in my heart. Yeah. Our memory verse. Yeah. It's about faith. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm still kind of struggling with it. So it's Hebrews. Look, I got it right here. I just want to read it real quick. Okay. Just so that I can show everybody that it is right here. We're not yeah. just making stuff up. All right. It's Hebrews 11, 1. Faith is being sure of what we hope for. It is being sure of what we do not see. Dude, you got it. Was, you, you taught me it. Well, <laughs> yeah, but I mean, you do have a good teacher, I guess. <laughs> All right. So can we do it with them? Yeah, let's um, do it. You, you, I'll do it. You repeat it. Okay. Okay. Because I need to practice this. Yes. So, faith, faith, mustard seed, faith, mustard, faith is being sure. Is being sure. Like, mm, solid, sure. Yeah, I am. I'm sure. Sure. Of what we hope for. Of what we hope for. You remember, you're repeating it with me. It is being sure. It is being sure. Of what we do not. Of what we do not. Is it do not or cannot? Do not. I think it's do not. It's do not. Do not. Do not. See. I'm just going to do see. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> those, those binoculars are more comfortable. Yeah, absolutely. So, faith. Faith. Is being sure. Is being sure of. Of what we hope for. What we hope for. It is being sure. It is being sure. What we do not. What we do not. See. See. Mm, that's a good one. I do. Agree. I think I it's really a good am. verse to just hide in your heart. So yep. when you're struggling with things, you can remember what it is to have faith and uh, to be sure of yep. what we do not see. And remember, we can have faith in things that we can't see because of all the things that we do see. Have seen over the years. Yep. That is a great verse to like take a highlighter or a pen or crayon even and just circle it. I mean, have you I, ever highlighted in your Bible with a crayon? Nope. But yeah, it I, just came to my mind. I don't think you would after you tried it. it. It's, it's not might, that easy. It might tear your paper. Yeah. Let's just stick away from the crayon. Highlighters. Highlighters pens. work. Pencils would work. I think a highlighter to highlight makes sense. Mm. There's something to that. There. I don't know what. It you means. think they're related? No. Okay. Anyway, anyway, so I am hoping, I, it's not certain yet, but I am hoping, I am having faith that we will have a special guest today. Ooh. After this? After this. Well, because there's no one in the room right now, yeah. so, so we'll see. I'm not going to call it today yet of what I want to call today because I'm not sure if this person will be in here today. So I can't call it what I want to call it, but if she can be in the video, then I'm going to call it that then. Clear as mud. Mm, that was. So, yeah. Cool. Hopefully, but I still have the game. So yeah. We're, we got that. I'm still going to beat you all. We'll see. All right. We'll see you later. What's up, Coronacation? All right. Yeah. I'm with Tanya. I told you that we had a special guest, but I wasn't sure when I told you if I was gonna be able to get her, but she made time for us. Yep. How cool is that? Just for you. So today is called Move It Monday. <laughs> Here's the deal. If we sit around too much, we get lazy. Mm -hmm. But when you get up and you get active and you start moving around, you almost have more energy. It's true, I mean, true I, story. Yep. And Tanya, over the last year, has like really helped me get back in shape. And so we this want- This guy's worked hard though. He's worked really hard. Look at these muscles. So we now want to help you guys get started because you know, you can't always come up to City Station Fitness and work out, but you can work out at home. And that's one thing that Tanya has I taught me. I can bring me. it to you. Yes, I can bring it to you. Don't forget, it's summertime. We want to lay out. We want to hang out. We want to go to the pool. And we want to just chill because you know, it's summer. That's right. But we have tryouts coming up. We want to show up like a boss on the field. So you have 10 minute AMRAP today. AMRAP, A-M-R-A-P, stands for as many reps as possible. Cool. So you will okay. have 10 minutes. To do as much as I can. That's right, so I will give you four exercises. We're gonna to try to hit the whole body with these four exercises. All right, so we have four moves. So you will have five, 10, 15, and 20. So our exercises today are five burpees, Oh, burpees. 10 push-ups. Work that chest, yep. 15 squats. Okay. Working that lower body. And then 
we have 25 or 20 jumping jacks to get that heart rate back up. Let's do it. Are you ready? Yeah, let's show them what? We show them one round and then yep. they can finish the 10 minutes. At That's their house. right. You'll just get any, you can have your own timer, have someone set a timer for you. You're going to repeat that 5, 10, 15, and 20 throughout that whole 10 minutes. I want y'all to do this Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Let's All do right, it. here we go. Well, I'm going to show you how to do the burpees. Are you ready? Yeah, let's favorite do it. exercise. Let's do it. All right, so this incorporates kind of a squat, a plank, and a push up. Okay. So, the first thing we're going to do is go down the floor, put our hands on the floor, and hop our feet back. Okay. We're going to do a push up, come up, and then we jump to the top. Okay. I'm going to take my tag off here. Are you ready? Yep. All right, Andrew, let's go. Ready? Let's get on the ground and hands on the floor, pop it back. Do a push up, come up, bring the feet in, do a hop at the top. So, get to work, buddy. All right, ready? I'm going to turn sideways uh -huh. so they can see this one. All right, so go down, down, down back, push up, dive, and jump. Perfect form right here. You want to do just like this. Look, see how his back stays nice and tight, so you want to tuck that belly button up? Keep everything from your shoulders to your knees, nice and tight. Take that push up down, come up, reach for the ceiling. So make your heart rate up. This is fun here. All right, All right five. five. You don't want to do any more than that, right? Not this round. <laughs> All right. So let's work on that chest. Okay. All right. We're going to let's take do it. it down and do a push up. The key with the push up, guys, is not just your arms. It's your whole entire body from your shoulders to your knees. You want to hold it real, real tight. You're squeezing everything so like, and just moving those arms. Yeah, like as if somebody's going to come in. Give you a gut buster right there. You're going to hold it tight. So let's go down. Okay. I'll talk about it. There so, you go. Alright, so. Yeah, your knees, yeah? Mm -hmm. So you're gonna go up on your toes for this first one. We're gonna show you toes and the knee version. So go up on your toes. Everything from your shoulders to your knees are nice and tight. Now you're gonna start bending those elbows, try to keep them closer to your body, then wing them out. Beautiful. And then straight back up. Let's finish 10 more, or nine more. Let's see. Two, count with me. Three, four, and five. Be shaking. Six, seven, eight. And nine, that was your last one. Great job. All right, so now let's show them the modification when we take it to our yeah. knees. So same thing here, guys. You're just going to hold everything from your shoulders to your knees nice and tight. You're going to kind of slide in and make your back nice and flat, holding it tight. Now bend those elbows and take it down and back up. Same thing, same principles. You're just going down on your knees. It's just a little bit easier while we're trying to get stronger. So squats. Okay. Okay, that's part of... Uh, leg day, we want to make sure that we're strong. So let's put our feet hip width apart. So our heels are just right below our, our hip bones right here. First thing you're going to do is this. just kind of think about a chair behind you. Okay. And we're going to go back with our rear end and try to find that seat behind us. All right, and then we're going to come back up. At all times, weight is in your heels. Yep. You should be able to move your toes as you do the whole entire thing. All right, so now you've got 15 to do. Ready? Take it down and back. So keep on going. See how his back is nice and flat out? You want a nice flat line right here. You don't want to sink in this way, and you don't want to arch your back. Very good. What is that? I don't know. This is eight. Come on. Stay with it. You're pressing to the heel, so you can move to the top. You've got four more after this. Come on. Good job. All right. See that, guys? That's perfect form right there. Last one. One more. Awesome. Okay. Now, last one is pretty easy. I'm pretty sure every single one of you have done this. Oh, yeah. They definitely have. The jumping jack. All right. So, generally, you know, it's just your normal jumping jack, so you can make them fast. You can slow them down. And if you have someone working out with you who can't do all that jump around, you can modify okay, it. So yeah. you can step it out. There's always a way to stay in the game and keep moving. So, jump That's back, the buddy. point. Just keep moving. Keep moving. Don't Move it give Monday. Up. Keep moving. Do not give up. All right, I'm just going to bust them out. Bust them out? Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Dude, you are a fit man. <sighs> So I like that's movie. it. 5, 10, 15. You keep repeating that for 10 minutes. Yeah. All right. Okay. Great job, Andrew. Thanks, Tanya. I really okay. appreciate you showing us yep. that. Next week, yep. will you teach us again? Yep, I will. I will be here each Monday for Move It Monday. Sweet. All right, Corey. So I have made you a new game. It is called Summer Snack Search. And I tested it out <laughs> on the boys. <laughs> And they did pretty good. It stumped them a few times. I want to see if you can do better than them and if Coronacation can do better than you. All right, so the idea of this game is there's going to be a bunch of snacks and stuff pop up on the screen. But I'm going to give you some ones, some specific snacks to find. 
Your job is to find those before the time runs out. Boys, is there any other instructions that I am missing? No. That you should tell Corey? No. Uh, that pretty much sums it up, right? All right, Corey, let's see how you do. All right, crew indication, summer snack search. Here we go. Let's see, let's see. Instructions, find the snack item before time runs out. Ooh, I gotta find it. Can you find the watermelon? Oh, yeah, found it real quick. Hmm, that was in the middle, pretty easy. Might get a little bit harder. Can you find the cookie? The cookie, uh-oh. Oh, there. That was just in time by the uh, soccer ball. Find the cherry, 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 cherry. Uh, oh boy, there's so much pressure in this game. Find the popcorn. Oh. Whew. Find the hamburger. Oh, hamburgers are good. Or, yeah, that's a cheeseburger. Cheeseburger, found it by the starfish. Whew. That was a quick one. Andrew, these are quick. Just like three seconds. Find the popsicle. Oh, by the first one. <sighs> the watermelon. Popcorn. Uh oh. Uh oh. I haven't seen the popcorn yet. Time's ticking. Oh, I didn't find it. Time ran out. It was right there in the middle. Find the pizza. Here we go. Pizza, pizza, pizza. Found it. Top left. Oh, different pizza. I was wrong. Oh, can you find the ice cream? Uh, oh boy. Uh-oh. I'm not gonna get this one either. By the other pizza. Andrew, you're stumping me, man. Blueberries, oh, those are good. I found them. It's redeemed by the strawberries, keeping the fruit together. Nice, good job, good job. Pineapple, oh, I haven't seen the pineapple on here yet. Oh, I found the pineapple tree. Pineapple, by the baseball. Or star. No, wrong pineapple again! Oh, two, oh, oh boy. Um, okay, I found the green one. I can't find the other one. Strawberry? Uh, no. Peach. Can you find the drink and the ice cream? All right, we found the ice cream already. If only I could remember. Ice cream. Okay, and the drink. There's the drink right beside it, but is that the right drink? I, I think so. I could be wrong. Oh, it was a different popsicle even. Ah, all right, purple pineapple, chocolate glazed donut. Gotta remember this. Purple, pineapple, purple, pineapple. Oh, found the purple pineapple. Chocolate glazed donut. Both of them are at the top. That's intense. Three. All right, the uh, peach drink, the steak, and the uh, grapes. Peach drink, found it. Steak, steak, where are you, steak? Oh no. I can't find the steak. Oh, there's the steak. I didn't find the steak or the grapes. Ran out of time. Ice cream, peanut, purple candy, chocolate with a bite missing. Ice cream, peanut, purple candy. Okay, ice cream. Ice cream. Ice cream. <laughs> okay, uh, cookie. Or no, chocolate with the bite missing. Found it. Okay. Um, oh, no. I'm going to run out of time before I find the other ones. Ah, the peanut was in between them. I was looking in the wrong spot. I only got two. I got two of those four. Man, I bet you guys did pretty good with that. Finding those things is definitely hard work. Hey, good job playing today, and I will catch you tomorrow. See ya.